Hello everyone, thank you for joining us again here at Bali Inc. My name is Steven Maida and today I'll be going over the different feeds for our KBH line. Um, today, right now, we have our end feed. This is going to be a straight. This is a direct straight angle feed and today I'm going to show you how to, how to put this together. The components of this are going to be these, these caps. It's going to look just like an end cap. So, looks just like an end cap. Only difference is there's going to be a hole at the end of it to put our wire through right now and then we have our wire gland already pre-set up is going to be our four terminal or three terminals are set up right now we're, I'm going to show you how to install the fourth one this does come with stickers so you can uh, mark them with line L1, L2 and L3 it also has a ground ground sticker I don't know if you can see that so for right now I'm going to go ahead and install the last one. And what this is, it's going to come with an Allen wrench right here. And then here's your terminal. You're going to slide this at the, onto there and make it flush with the end. You're going to take your little Allen wrench. You're going to tighten it down. And this set screw is going to hold it on there. All right. Next. You're going to take your wire, as your wire, you're going to take off this nut, okay, and take your gland, take all four wires, Gonna loosen that up, take all four wires, put it through here, and feed it through the end of this, feed your nut, over the top of your wires and start putting on your, your hex nut to hold down your hold in your gland. And the back side of this is actually positioned with these to make sure it doesn't allow that hex nut to turn. Alright? Get that tight. I'm gonna go ahead and slide that in. At the end, just like an end cap would be. All right. First of all, you're gonna take one of these, take this washer and this nut, and you're gonna find out where the ground is first. You're always gonna know where the ground is um, based on the, the yellow and green markings on the side. And I already know which one is my ground. It's, it's gonna be this one. So we're gonna turn this around. We're gonna line this up. Put this on the terminal. Take these special washers that help. That also, this washer is special because with vibration, it doesn't come loose like your regular style crush washers. All right. So we're gonna take these one by one, these washers and these hex nuts, and we're gonna go ahead and put these on here. I already know which one's lined up because I took it apart. The best thing you could do is before installation is take a picture of where these wires went. Just so you know that they're going to go back exactly where they went before. Slowly but surely. Take your time. No rush. I know y'all got a lot of business out there, but just don't want to make... I have to come do a job twice. So take your time, make it look pretty, show them why you make the big bucks out there. All right. Now we're gonna take our 10 millimeter. These are 10 millimeter hex nuts. And you don't wanna over torque these. And our installation manual is going to say 1.5 to 2 nm, which translates to 14 to 17 foot pounds torque. Snug up, makes these look nice and pretty and straight. You want them to be next to each other, and, and especially this ground and hot on this side can potentially get close to each other. So you want to make sure they're straight. 
and that these are in the right position. All right, all these are secured down. This is just for demonstration, and I recommend to get your, your torque wrench out to torque these are proper torques. Nice and nice and stuck. All right. Next, we're going to make sure this wire is pretty. We're going to tighten down this, this wire gland. So it's nice and snug. So it's not pulling on our wires and our terminals in there. Voila. Then, we're going to take our two clamshells caps. We're going to line it up on the bottom under here underneath this lip. And then we're gonna line up on this lip at the very edge. Okay. Make sure. Come back on this side. Here are two snaps together. And that's it.